Hey everybody, Brian Aikens, Rebel Relics. Uh, we're at the house today. I wanted to show you guys some uh, really nice Rebel Relics. We got Big Mom on the iPhone. Kind of the B team, but she's doing a good job. This is a McElroy and Hunt Confederate frame buckle on its original belt. I've only seen one other one before uh, of this style. And it was stitched the same way. I've seen a few guys that I didn't like that had different kind of stitching. I didn't like the buckle, the belt, and I really didn't like the stitching on them. But the other one that I saw that I knew was authentic had the same one line of stitching there. If you remember that cap box, Confederate cap box I recently sold, it had the same uh, tanning process to the belt. This side here is kind of what you expect to see. Then on the inside of the belt, you kind of have that classic Confederate leather that we call, some people call it pigskin or whatever. This buckle is uh, McElroy and Hunt, making Georgia maker marked on the inside. I don't think the iPhone is going to pick it up. But uh, guys, just wanted to share this with you. Let's do a few other little teasers here. Here's a Virginia style rectangle, beautiful sand casting, wonderful file marks, everything on its crisp as it should be. Here's one of the rarest buckles you may ever see. Here's a six North Carolina on the original belt. And uh, one more little teaser, guys. I'm gonna do some videos on them too. But uh, here is a uh, British Sergeant's Fusil. Super rare, I think there's maybe less than 10 of them known. It's got the big 5 8 inch Georgia on the side. Blockade number 22. This was on the uh, Confederate ship Gladiator, guys. Um, the case number, I believe, is 67. I've got a copy of the uh, Gladiator Manifest, and it's on a part of the Manifest that's in great shape. You can see everything about this gun. It's a Parker Field and Son. These fusils, too, uh, were made for a socket bayonet. You see no, no lug up here for a saber bayonet. Anyway, we'll do a good video on this one. Uh, Check out rebelrelics.com, guys. Uh, give me a big rebel yell if you need anything. Thank you.